friends, this is Dr. Sangeetha and welcome back to another lecture of Dental Paatshala where we help you understand and learn dentistry better and easy way. And this video we are going to talk about the disorders of the tongue. So without further ado, let's get started. we cover each topic under five headings in five minutes and today's topic is the geographic tongue or the migratory glossitis as the name suggests what it signifies it is going to be such a lesion that it changes its location it moves and changes its location each time it spreads so one lesion get disappears then somewhere else the lesion occurs so this is the geographic or the migratory glossitis term signifies so basically it is a multifocal it is a patchy irregular lesion it is not confined to any specific location. It changes its position and which is because of the depapillation of the tongue of the filiform papillae. So what happens? There is a filiform papillae. There is also fungiform papillae that we know that, right? So what happens when there is a filiform and fungiform papillae? Now the filiform papillae, these are the white color one, right? So what happens when these white color papillae is missing in, suppose they are missing in this region, right? So what happens? Only red color papillae are present. So there will be presence of some red dots because, see, because filiform papillae, these are white in, white in color, right? So, and we have also have the fungiform papillae. So there is a loss of filiform papillae. Now what happens? Now, because the fungiform papillae, they are red in color. So, the, there are no white lesion because there is loss of filiform, right? The white, uh, the suppose this black is our white, right? So, the, this, suppose this black is the white in tongue. So, what happens? There are white papillae present all over the tongue, right? So, these are the filiform papillae. Now, when we remove in specific, some specific area, see. Now, I just want to show you fast so now what happens if this black i mean white color papillae which are our filiform papillae they went missing right and only the fungiform papillae are present so it appears like that it is demarcated with the white line so because otherwise outside this line Outside this line, there are white papillae, there are the filiform papillae. But inside this patch, because there are not filiform papillae, there are only fungiform papillae. So, it appears like this patch is a red color patch. So, this is basically irregular, patchy, depapillated areas present on the dorsum of the tongue and they keep on changing their locations, right? And usually demarcated with a white line. Now, these are asymptomatic, but... Sometimes people can complain of the burning sensation in the tongue, right? Burning sensation or the soreness in the tongue. The, that is the glossodynia. Then also it can occur in association with the fissured tongue or scrotal tongue, which we have already covered and psoriasis also it can be accompanied with. So if we look at the histological section, the superficial layer, it contains intercellular edema. There is a swelling in the superficial layer and infiltration of neutrophils, which is called as the spongiotic abscess. And the epithelium is hyperparacretinized with the loss of filiform papillae. The connective tissue contain inflammatory cells which is similar to the hyperplastic candidiasis. Except the candida hyphae. Except candida hyphae are not there. So there is no specific treatment as such for geographic tongue. But again some patients the heavy dose of vitamin uh, produces some result and some patients we give antihistaminic and local steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs so that also works in some people but there is no specific treatment as such so guys this is about the geographic tongue or the migratory glossitis the important thing you have to remember is the filiform papillae is absent and because of that the patch will contain only the red color papillae which are the fungiform papillae. Otherwise rest of the tongue, the filiform papillae will be present. So because rest of the tongue has the white color patch, so it appears like a white demarcation is there. It keep on changing its location. It is usually asymptomatic. So this is about the geographic tongue or the migratory glossitis. 
I hope that you guys are clear with the migratory glossitis or the geographic term. So if you have enjoyed the video, then give it a thumbs up also. You can comment in the comment section below. And there is a link in the description box below to support me on Paytm as well as on PayPal to make free videos for you guys and to make free notes. So guys, till then, keep reading, keep learning, stay motivated. I will see you soon in the next video.